Distinguished guests, dear professors, participants, colleagues, good morning. On behalf of the University of Mishko and Central European Academy and our co-organizing partners, I warmly welcome all of you to our international conference on the contemporary threats to parental responsibility, selected legal aspects. The conference forms part of the Central European Professors Network and it presents the results of the work carried out by the members of the research group led by Professor Pavel Shopchik. Today's event is connected to the presentation of the book entitled Content of the Right to Parental Responsibility, Experiences, Analyses, Postulates, which has been edited by Professor Pavel Shopchik also. It is my great honor and privilege to welcome our distinguished guests. Dr. Marcin Romanovsky, Under Secretary of State at the Ministry of Justice of the Republic of Poland and Assistant Professor at the Faculty of Law of the Cardinal Stefan Wyszynski University in Warsaw. Professor Marcin Wielesz, Director of the Institute of Justice in Warsaw and the Vice Dean of the Faculty of Law of the Cardinal Stefan Wyszynski University in Warsaw. Professor Pavel Shopchik, Deputy D Director of the Institute of Justice in Warsaw and Dean of the Faculty of Law of the University of Opol. Professor Janos Edesiladi, the Director of the Ferenc Madel Institute of Comparative Law and the Chair of the Labor and Agricultural Law Department at the Faculty of Law of the University of Miskolc. I welcome all the speakers and all the colleagues and participants who took their time to join us today. I would like to extend my gratitude to the Hungarian Academy of Sciences, Miskolc Regional Committee for hosting today's conference. By speaking about the results, I would like to grab the opportunity to present you briefly the Central European Academy and the outcomes of, of our work in 2022. The Central European Academy began its work on 1st January 2022 as part of the University of Miskolc. The tasks of the Central European Academy are the following. Managing research and training projects in Central Europe dedicated for legal professionals and for young researchers as well. Our two flagship projects are the Central European Professors Network and the Central European Junior Programme creating and supporting a professional network involving Central European countries and publishing English language scholarly books and journals through its own publishing house, Central European Academic Publishing. Let me say a few words about the Central European Professors Network. Its main objective is to create a Central European network of legal researchers through closer cooperation that is through activities in international comparative law research. First edition started on 1st January 2021, at the time coordinated by the Ferenc Madel Institute for Comparative Law, now organized by the Central European Academy. But the second edition started in 2022, we have launched altogether five research groups with active participation of 47 researchers from seven countries. On this slide and on the next one, you can see the names of the groups, their leaders and members. The five research groups are, the first is the constitutional protection of national symbols under the leadership of Zoltan Tooth. The second research group is the right to privacy, is led by Marcin Vielec. The name of the third research group is content of the right to parental responsibility. Here the leader of the research group is Pavel Shopchi. The fourth research group is the constitutional framework for the protection of future generations and the environment. This program is led by Janos Edesiladi. 
And the topic of last research group is constitutional identity and relations between the European Union law and the domestic law of member states. Here the leader is András Varga G. Within 2022 professors network, each research group organized two international conferences and several dissemination events of different kinds, for example, webinars, lectures, press interviews, or roundtable discussions. In 2022, members of 2022 professors network organized altogether 49 dissemination events. Our second flagship project is the Central European Junior Program, which consists of a four-year PhD program <coughs> at the Deak Ferenc Doctoral School of the University of Miskolc, <coughs> and a four-year-long internship program at the Central European Academy. First PhD students started the junior program in September 2021. The second year started the program in September 2022. Altogether, there are 19 PhD students in the Central European Junior Program, all of them graduated from different universities in our region. There are several aims of the Central European Junior Program. They are connected both to scientific research and to day-to-day -to -day internship activities. The program offers various opportunities for the PhD students, including foreign language courses, summer schools, and above all, networking and experiencing the international environment. The third pillar of the Central European Academy is the Central European Academy Publishing. It is our own publishing house specialized in legal scholarly books and journals in English language. Currently, CEA Publishing publishes two book series, The Legal Studies on Central Europe and the Studies of the Central European Professors Network, as well as two legal journals, Central European Journal of Comparative Law and the Law, Identity and Values. Soon, a third journal will be launched, the CEA Law Review, in which articles written by the PhD students will be published. The first book series, The Legal Studies on Central Europe, consists of English language books dedicated in the first place to the PhD students. It forms part of the curriculum for the Central European Comparative Law PhD program. In 2022, 10 such books have been written by the authentic scholars from the Central European countries. Some of them have already been published. You can see them on the slide lectures on East, European, East Central European history of law, regulation of public finances in light of financial constitutionality, comparative constitutionalism in Central Europe, and the development of European and regional integration theories in Central European countries. And some are still under publication process and will be published by the end of this year. For example, Criminal Legal Studies, European Challenges and Central and Eastern European Responses in the Criminal Sciences of the 21st Century or Contract Law in East Central Europe or International Law from a Central European Perspective. The second book series, The Studies of the Central European Professors Network, was established in 2021 by the Ferenc Madel Institute and it is closely connected to the Central European Professors Network. In 2021, four books were published as a result of the project. In 2022, further five books will be published, which will contain the results of the 22, 20, uh, 22 Professors Network. Within our publishing activity, we also cooperate with the Ferenc Madel Institute of Comparative Law. As a result of this cooperation, a book on emergency powers in Central Europe was published this year. As uh, far as our legal journals are concerned, the Central European Journal of Comparative Law aims to become a forum for comparative legal research in the field of private and public law of the Central European countries. Manuscripts are also accepted in the fields of political science, for example, comparative politics, and international relations, 
The journal favors thematic topics in order to promote easier comparability. The journal attaches particular importance to providing best practices and making different legal solutions accessible and understandable to the group of countries concerned. In addition to comparative law articles, journal also aims to publish academic papers that can serve as a starting point for comparative law research. In the law identity and values, we publish academic articles which relate to the specific values of the Central European region and which reflect the unique identity of Central Europe. The journal aims to publish legal articles that present the specific legal uh, traditions of the Central European countries. Low identity and values is not only an academic journal, but also a mission to respect the traditions of Central European countries, which have unique legal solutions to certain issues. As I mentioned before, we also plan to launch a third journal under the title Central European Academy Law Review. It will be a journal run by the PhD students and its primary purpose will be to establish an academic publication forum for young legal scholars and practitioners. It will be published twice a year. To sum up, uh, within, the cent within the 2022 Central European Professors Network, we have organized nine international conferences this year, five in Budapest, two in Miskolc, and two in Warsaw. Within the 2022 Central European Junior Program, we have organized six international conferences, five events to introduce the PhD books and the annual scientific of the Central European Academy, which was a conference organized almost entirely by our PhD students. Apart from that, we have invited to Hungary several VIP lectures and PhD supervisors to deliver lectures for our students. Almost all our students participated in various summer courses and trainings in renowned academic institutions all over Europe. Ladies and gentlemen, there is nothing left but uh, to wish you uh, an inspiring and uh, pleasant conference. And I would like to thank you for your attention. Thank you very much. <clears throat>